Okay, we're here at 5327 Tyrone Avenue in the city of Sherman Oaks. Uh, we're here to inspect the main sewer line. We can't check every single pipe in the house. You'll have your general inspector um, check as much as he can, run all the sinks, make sure everything's draining correctly. We're here to check the main sewer line. Now, this inspection is based on my opinion. Right now, what we're doing is we're running the camera from a three inch end of the line clean out that's on the left back side of the house, right by the water heater and the electric meter. And it's clean out runs all the way through the house and then goes all the way to the middle of the street. Right now, we're all the way at the city connection. There's a city connection right there. You have a six inch clay connection to the city. And then what happens is we have a cured in place pipe lining. The cured in place pipe lining is a fiberglass lining that was shot from the property line pretty much all the way up to the city connection. Now this cured in place pipe lining at this time looks like it's in good condition. There's no issues with it. I highly stress if you ever have a blockage, never run a blade with a cable or a cable with a blade because it can uh, damage the lining. So you can see the lining at this time is in good condition. Comes onto the property, transitions to a four inch ABS plastic pipe. The four inch ABS plastic pipe is in good condition, nice and clean. Still four inch ABS plastic pipe. And then what it does is it transitions to a four inch clay pipe. Now the four inch clay pipe, as we come back, we'll have a look at it. So far, it looks like it's in pretty fair condition. You see, you do have some minor cracks around the hub where the two pieces of pipe to connects. Now, you're gonna find little cracks, sometimes little bit of roots, little bit of offsets in a clay pipe, very typical. What we look for are major roots, major breaks, um, those kind of things. But what I'll do is I'm just gonna locate this just to see where the end of the clay is. We know where it exits. We're gonna go ahead and pause this. Put a bank. Yeah. Okay, so basically we located that in the driveway underneath the pavers, approximately about three and a half feet deep. And like you see, we come back to clay. And like I told you, you know, minor cracks, minor offsets, minor roots are very common. You can see you do have a crack there at the hub. Another crack here around the hub. Now, the line is maintainable. Uh, there's no issues in it right now. It's functioning. And keep coming back see this is still clay so it didn't look too bad uh, two minor stress cracks in the clay pipe uh, very common very normal to see that now we're gonna come underneath the house to a cast iron pipe now this is the cast iron pipe it looks like it's in pretty fair condition it's nice and round still it's got very minor rust buildup Doesn't look too bad. Keep in mind, don't flush baby wipes, paper towels, Tampax, those kind of things. Those can be uh, an issue in the cast iron pipe, so just don't flush that. The cast iron, as we come back, you can see nice and round, very minor rust buildup. Pretty fair condition underneath the house. Overall, the sewer line looks pretty good. Okay, we're coming back towards the clean out here. Okay, here we are in the back of the house. Okay, so we'll go ahead and we'll stop the recording.